Hello travelers, welcome to my channel Ani Travel Vlogs. Today's video is the final episode of my Russia series which is the city of Sochi. We will highlight my experience on Sochi, the skiing bikini festival, Caucasian mountains, Caucasian cuisine, our yacht tour in the Black Sea and much more. So let's get started. Today morning we flew from Moscow to the beautiful city of Sochi. As many of you have never heard the name Sochi, so let me brief you on Sochi. Sochi is a Russian city on the Black Sea and is known as the Summer Beach Resort and was host of the 2014 Winter Olympics. Forested Sochi National Park is a 1937 square kilometer protected area in the nearby Caucasus Mountains. As soon as we landed in Sochi, we head towards our hotel. Needless to say that our hotel was on a mountain top. The road towards our hotel was beautifully mountain clad landscape along with foggy clouds which made it look like a beautiful hill station. This city had very very different landscape in comparison to Moscow and St. Petersburg, my earlier visited cities in Russia. The hotel that we stayed in for the next few days had some amazing facilities including a swimming pool, a spa and a sauna. The food spread was amazing including Russian and continental cuisine. The view just outside the hotel was extremely mesmerizing. This is the Mazimta river flowing through the city of Sochi. Mazimta is the largest river in Russia emptying into the Black Sea. It is 89 kilometers long with a watershed of 885 square kilometers. head towards the bikini festival. We had to go up the mountains by a ropeway to reach the festival location. While going up, the beautiful view of the city and the mountains made us ecstatic. Now let's talk about the festival in detail. The Bikini Skiing Festival in Sochi is tagged as the world record event with more than a thousand participants who collected to create the record. On every 1st of April, the event goes live with thousands of bikini clad participants weaseling by you on the slopes of the ski mountains. This makes for a very unique experience rarely to be seen elsewhere. The event is witnessed by hundreds of thousands and the atmosphere in Krasanya Paulinia is like a huge festival with open air bars, kids entertainment, adventure sports and lovely bikini clad women and handsome men strutting their stuff on the slope. The environment is extremely electric with live shows and demonstrations, fun and games on the snow covered slopes of the resort. The climate is also very unique as there is snow on the ground and the air is missing the nip, providing for a comfortable experience in the outdoors. enjoyed a lot in this festival and this was one of a kind experience for me. After the festival, we head towards lunch. Mm -hmm. 
So the cuisine in Sochi is Caucasus cuisine, which includes the traditional cuisines of the countries in West Asia, of Georgia, Azerbaijan in Transcaucasia, and of Eastern Europe in North Caucasus. Next, we head to our yacht tour of the Black Sea. Now before that, let's have a view of the Black Sea from one of the hotels where we went for our inspection. The Black Sea is a body of water and marginal sea of the Atlantic Ocean between Eastern Europe, the Caucasus and Western Asia. It is supplied by a number of major rivers including the Danube, Dnieper, Southern Bag, Dniester, Don and the Rioni. On the yacht tour, we enjoyed a lot with our white and red wine. That's it from Russia until we meet next time. Overall, my travel experience in Russia has been amazing. I will definitely come back to Russia and explore the country more. The three cities I visited gave me an uber experience and I'm ready to dive in more. If you like this video, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. You can also email me your queries on Russia or travel in general. Keep watching Annie Travel Blogs.